Hi, I'm Jimmy Conrad, and with Manchester United struggling again, I had to come find their supporters at Danny Coyles in San Francisco and give them a hard time. You know, just poke the bear. How does it feel to support a club that probably won't be as great as it once was? <laughs> <laughs> um, wow, that's good. It is. I'm coming with the heat right away. Um, I really think that once you make the decision to be a United fan, it's a decision for life. Man United will always be great. You can't say that it will not be great in the future. It has the biggest fan base in the world by far. I'll always follow them, through thick or thin. Rain or shine, we support the club. We're through and through. We're united. We're red. Do you ever think they're going to match that greatness that they yes. once had? Absolutely. Really? They're going to come back. I mean, I'm sure we'll get it together, but something's just not right right now. They're going to figure things out, and, they're go and we're going to bounce back. Okay. Yeah. Right. This this is a blip. We really will come back, and if we don't, I mean, we're, we're still going to be hopeful and <laughs> hopefully get to that point again. Do you ever wish that Manchester City's owner, Sheikh Mansour, maybe bought the team instead of those Americans? No, no, not necessarily. Yeah, yeah. No. No, no oil money for you. No. <laughs> <laughs> but it wins trophies. It wins trophies. It, it does, it does. But we were winning trophies before then. I think they would like it, but at the same time, I think they just want to go back to what Ferguson left and which was the dynasty. Absolutely no way. <laughs> no amount of money can buy greatness that is earned through history, so no. I think the Glazers and, and the American owners, they know who to put the right people into the job. Now, if Mourinho doesn't work out, they'll get the right people, we'll get it done. If there was one word or phrase to describe the current Manchester United team and this season, what would it be for you? Rudderless. Temporary. Crisis. Struggle. Chaos. Mm, that's a good one. I was going to say dumpster fire or train wreck, but that works too. So how do you solve these current problems then? I don't think we have all the players that that we need, and I think we need to get rid of some players. We need a couple of quality center backs. I think having another striker when Lukaku's not doing so good is always, always a positive. Leaders. You know, leaders. We need leaders. We need leaders. Yeah. There's nobody leading on the field. I heard David Moyes is available. No, no. <laughs> Let's not go there. Yeah, all right, all right. That's, that's fair. All right, that is it. The people have spoken, but now it is my turn. And I'm going to say this. I believe that the players definitely have to take responsibility for their uneven performances. But you can't fire all 25 of those guys, so you have to fire the one manager instead with the hopes that that fixes everything. And I think that they will if this form continues. Anyway, thank you for watching me in the street, and I'll see you next time.